on line with me is a spine surgeon, Dr. Raghuram G. Good morning to you. Good morning, Prithvi. Aya, aya, aya. Prithvi, Bangalore ka Dr. Raghuram Ji is consultant neurosurgeon and spine surgeon, Manipal Hospital, Yashwantpur. Thank you so much for your time this morning, Dr. Raghuram. My pleasure, Prithvi. Turns out there are a lot of spine injuries. Actually, I was, I had one such. I had a slip disc long back. Okay. I'm fully recovered, however. Let me ask Good. you, what are the five signs of spinal injury, Dr. Raghuram? Yeah. So, like you said, Prithvi, spine injury has become a major issue now for many of the people, even including youngsters. The commonest signs that we see of spinal injury is pain in the back is the most commonest symptom. Mm -hmm. Many of them come to us with low back pain. So that is one of the earliest signs of your spine telling you, please take care of me. The next common thing is this pain, which is not only in the back now, is started to come to my leg also, doctor. So that is the second important sign that we look for. That is sciatic, right? Yes, exactly. So it becomes like a sciatic pain. So it's not only causing muscle pain in the back, it's also started to irritate the nerve root which is coming to your leg and that is causing the pain to come to the leg. The third thing is once the pain becomes more and more, more longer duration, then you start complaining of some abnormal sensation like tingling, right. numbness right. or burning in the leg. So this is another sign of spine injury. And some patients who unfortunately are involved in road traffic accidents come to us with frank weakness of the legs. That mm -hmm. means they say, doc, I cannot move my leg. Leg. Right. So that is another important sign that we look for. And in very, very severe case of injury, they also complain that they have no control of their urine or motion. So these are yeah. the commonest, you know, the progression of the symptoms that we see in patients with spinal injury. Which gender or age group gets more affected? Previously, it was thought that these spine problems happen only in the older people, you know, like right, as you, right, age, yeah. you tend to get arthritis and you tend to get, Correct. you know, more severe degeneration in the back. But mm -hmm. unfortunately, it's no longer like that. That. What has happened now is that we are seeing more and more patients coming to us, especially the younger age group. Just now I was telling you the working age group, which is actually the backbone of any country, you know, getting into these kind of symptoms, which actually leads to, you know, loss of their productive, you know, work because they, if they have severe back pain, they can't go for work. They lie down at home. So the age group that we are seeing now is almost like 35 to 55. So that is the commonest stage that we are seeing these kind of spinal injury problems. In terms of gender, the only specific thing is especially ladies can have a little osteoporosis especially the postmenopausal people mm. and if they don't take adequate calcium in their diet mm. they can have what is called as fractures of the backbone even with trivial faults so that is okay. the only thing in terms of gender otherwise it affects both of them equally one last question when should one visit a doctor when we were talking to you in the beginning so if there is a back pain you know which is persisting that means you just wake up with a back pain and it goes off by afternoon or evening then probably it's just that you had a muscle spasm but if it persists and this back pain is not going away even if you try your routine medication like a paracetamol and it's persisting or the other symptoms which I told you like back pain coming to the leg or abnormal sensation any of these signs I think you should immediately go and meet your spine specialist so that we can diagnose early and treat you appropriately it doesn't mean that everybody needs surgery it's just to give you the correct guidance at an early stage so that you can prevent it from getting worse Super, thank you so much for your time. That's Dr. Raghuram Ji, consultant, neurosurgeon and spine surgeon, Manipal Hospital, Yashwantpur. This is Fever 104 FM. I am Prithvi, Bangalore Ka Bond. Good morning to you.